Jin, you made it! Why are these people outside the town walls? The Mongols have surrounded Yarikawa. No one can get in. Recruiting Lord Shimura's old rivals was never going to be easy. But now... Now they need allies too. Think about it. We help them drive off the Mongols, and they help us. I need their word before I fight for them. And we can't even get into their city. Yes, we can. There's a hidden entrance. From when we were children. Even if it's still there, we can't reach it. It's worth a try. I know a place we can scout for a way around the Mongol siege. Strange being back after so many years. Everywhere I look brings back memories. Then try not to look so hard. Were you here when the Yarikawa Rebellion broke out? No. We left years earlier, when we were children. Did your parents move you? Something like that. That doesn't sound good. They're heading for town. Let them pass. They're clear. This way. I don't want to see this. You've seen worse. But this was home. Sooner or later, everyone has to return home and confront their past. Surrounded by the enemy. Yarikawa doesn't stand a chance. You know, where's the hidden entrance? See that river near the town walls. Get us that far, and I'll do the rest. We can't sneak past an army. And even if we find an entrance, what if the Mongols see us? We'll sentence the town to death. Taka, I stake my life on your metalwork. Now it's your turn to trust me. Yes, my lord. I don't see how we can make it to the river. We'll find a way. The walls won't keep this many Mongols out. Azamo Bay fell. Yarikawa will too. I know these people. They'll choose death before slavery. They'd take the fight to the Mongols. Draw them off. Please, no. Taka's right. Too risky. The hidden entrance used to be over there, behind that white tree. Let's hope the Mongols haven't found it. We just have to find a way through the camp. Once we reach the water, it should be easy to find the entrance without being spotted. That's our plan? Sneak through the biggest Mongol camp I've ever seen? Then hope the secret entrance we used as children is still there? Stay close, Taka. Count on it. Let's go. I can't believe I'm risking my life coming back to this dump. This was your idea. I need to prove my worth to your uncle. Earn us passage off this island. I loved it here. You were too young to know how it really was. Yariko was an ugly place for a girl without a handful of rice to her name. Is that why you left? No. I got us in trouble. It wasn't your fault.
you sure this is a good idea? Be ready to run. <laughs> I can't keep going. Just follow Jin to the river. We used to catch dragonflies here, didn't we? And make them fight. We'd pretend one was a Yarekawa samurai. And the other was a... a... A Shimura Samurai. And Shimura always locks him. Interesting choice. Under the waterfall. It's still here. And being put to good use. Probably why they've held out this long. When we get up there, let me do the talking. It's your hometown. Who are you? How did you get in? My brother and I were born here. Did the Mongols see you? No, but we're here to help you break their siege. First, tell me the name of the dead samurai you stole your gear from. He's not a thief. He's the ghost. The ghost? I'll take you to Ujimasa. But mind your step. We're all armed here. Run and tell the steward! Right away! Ujimasa? That was the name of Lord Yarikawa's youngest son. But my uncle disbanded their clan when he defeated them. The family still runs things here, unofficially. Your uncle put down a rebellion and created a generation of people who hate Clan Shimura. The Mongols are crossing the bridge! You three, follow me and stay close. What's going on? A disturbance at the main gate. That can't be good. It's their leader! Are they going to attack? Let's find out what they want. Anmar Min, people of Yarikawa, I am Temuge, leader of this war band. I learned your speech, so I may offer you a future. Open your gates before my camp flies the black flag, and you will know great mercy. Refuse, and you will know terrible misery. Choose your future, Yarikawa. They're leaving. Let's go. If Yariko surrenders, Lord Shimura won't get his army. Don't worry. They're too stubborn to surrender. If they don't, it will be a bloodbath. They need my uncle as much as he needs them. United, we can beat back the invaders. People here have bad memories of Lord Shimura. If they're going to survive, Yariko needs to let go of the past. Easier said than done. Ujimasa knows you're here. You two go ahead. I want to check on the swordsmith. Lord Sakai. Ujimasa Yariko. I never thought Lord Shimura's nephew would be responsible for the ghost. You best be careful, or he'll punish you. As he punished my once great family for inciting rebellion against your Jito. That was years ago. We've all got bigger problems now. Who's this? Your servant? I was born here. Yet you're aiding Clan Shimura. No, I'm fighting for Lord Sakai. For the ghost. We can help break the siege outside your walls. In return, Lord Shimura requests your help. <laughs> the Mongols want to conquer the mainland. They will lose interest in us. And Yarikawa will survive. Like we always do. That could have gone better. Let's find Taka. Ujimasa is a fool. He can be convinced. The whole island's burning, and Yarikawa is next. If that doesn't convince him, nothing will. Taka used to visit this swordsmith every day. If there was any leftover metal, 
He'd let my brother pretend to make swords. The swordsmith remembered you? Shinsuke passed away. That's his son. How did it go? Ujimasa thinks they can outlast the siege. The smith told me all the best archers left to fight the Mongols, against Ujimasa's orders. They've been missing for days. If we find these archers, they may help us break the Mongol siege and win the town's support. Meet me in old Yarikawa when you can. We'll look for them there. And show Yarikawa how to fight back. Shinsuke's son still has the rock. The one you use to hammer out your swords? It's so small. In my memory, it's huge. You spent hours with him. I'd have to drag you away. I'll see you in old Yarikawa, Jin. Mongols, searching for something powerful. Something our people have been hiding for years. If the Mongols want it, they believe it can help them in their fight. The story says the armor can turn even a simple farmer into a warrior. I wonder what it could do for a samurai. I'm no storyteller, my lord. But the musician Yamato tells it well. Last I heard, he was near Akashima. <laughs> 